Welcome to Positive Atheism English Channel. Today I am presenting you the book Gora, Social Revolutionary, written by Dr. Sunanda Sheth. Sixth chapter Gora, an educationalist. Gora and the reputation of being an ideal educator who made indelible impressions in the minds of his students. His former students such as Dr. G. Venkateswarlu who later became professor of botany at Andhra University, late P. V. V. Sheshagiri, former registrar of Andhra University, C. V. K. Rao, a communist leader, all expressed veneration for him, which broadened on the traditional devotion of a disciple for his guru. Gora believed that education was an important instrument of social change and education shaped the value system and molded the character of man. Since 1925, Gora conducted experiments in the technique of education with the young students. During his 15 years of service as a lecturer, Gora had ample opportunities to study student psychology. He felt that everyone was endowed with immense potentialities and with a sense of freedom and responsibility, they could work wonders. But it was essential to release such potentialities by inculcating in them the necessary courage and confidence. He conducted several experiments with students and his experiments strengthened his views on personal and individual capacities of the students. While Gora was in American Mission College, he conducted an experiment which was considered revolutionary in those days. He protested against the practice of selecting only bright students for the public examination based on their performance in the college. Gora recommended all the students in his class on the one hand and appealed to the students on the other to perform well in the examinations. He said, I have done my duty and now it is for you to do yours. The appeal worked well and the class secured high percentage of passes with a number of first classes and distinctions. Gora was prepared to experiment with his novel ideas in spite of the risks involved in it. Further experiments showed him that the consideration of the teacher at a personal level is more important. As a teacher, Gora used to mix freely with the students. He considered teachers and students as intellectual co-travelers. He never subscribed to the prevailing notion that the students must be docile and should bear unquestioning obedience to the teacher. His free and frank discussions with students and his sympathetic approach to their problems brought them close to Gora and they started rallying around him for inspiration. Gora encouraged them in extracurricular activities which he considered as important as the curricular studies and also organized study tours and cross-country cycle races in which students participated with great enthusiasm. Students appreciated the simple and informal way in which Gora was moving with them. They used to visit him with their families and Gora and his wife also paid visits to their houses. The social calls mingled them, crossing unconventional barriers of caste and communal differences. The happy relations had a healthy effect on the students and their studies. In addition to their studies, they had the benefit of knowing Gora's views on social reforms. Inspired by Gora's example, many of them cultivated self-discipline and social work. Later, many of his students came out brilliantly as professors, legislators, advocates and successful businessmen. Gora kept up good social relations with many of his old students throughout his life. Thank you. Please download Samaram multi-channel app and watch your favorite channels from your mobile. App available on Google Play Store and subscribe to the channels. For more videos, please subscribe to this channel Positive Atheism and activate the bell icon.